Hello, I'm Daniel. Today I'm going to show you how to edit and export uh, videos for Instagram in DaVinci Resolve 14. So here are the basic informations. The ratio is 4 to 5 and the minimum of the clip is 3 seconds, the maximum is 60 seconds. The resolution is based on your uh, files you import. If you have full HD files, your maximum resolution is 720 by 900. If you have 2 or 4K resolution video, you can export 1080 by 1350. So now let's jump in here. First thing you want to do, import your clips. I have already done, done this. this. This is 4K material. Then you go to File, um, Project Settings and Master Settings and here you can put in your resolution, it's 1080 by 1350 for me. I think the maximum frame rate is uh, 30 frames per second, so let's leave it at that. Next step, go to the color editor. So now you've, your file should look like this. And you want to fill the frame, so you have to zoom in. And to do that, you go to sizing, zoom, and you hit 2.22. That's the perfect ratio to fill the frame. Uh, let's see here. Zoom is 2.22. What you also can do is panning now. Depending on what you want to have in the middle of the frame. You can also do uh, shift the framing by setting uh, different keyframes. Uh, check out the video where I learned most of this from. It's the uh, WA Productions on YouTube. Really nice tutorial. And he explains this really well. So I don't go over, the, over this. Uh, I don't do anything in Fairlight. So now I show you the export settings. This is the most important. So I use QuickTime. H.264 and custom resolution again 1080 by 1350 and for me I think this one is the one that didn't work the quality should not be on automatic but restricted to 3500 kilobits per second and I have a lot of different clips that I want to render and they are all should all be separate clips, so I use this option individual clips, so it exports them all individually. So here are the settings again I used really quick. The output format QuickTime codec H264 resolution custom 1080 by 1350 and the quality restricted to 3500 kilobits per second. So. so, now let's hit Add to Render Queue and export it. So after you exported all the files su successfully, you can check them out. It should look like this. I think the quality is okay. And the size of the file should not be uh, over 150 megabyte, but this should should not be a problem. I think my files are around 10 and 20 megabytes. So yeah. And to bring it on the phone, I upload them simply to Google Photos so I can access and share them on my device anywhere I want. So that's it for me. Thanks a lot for watching. 
I will leave the link to the other channel with the keyframes in the to the uh, Wii Productions channel in the description below. Uh, if you liked the video, may subscribe to my channel or leave a like. Thanks a lot. See you next time.